We've been waiting for this since 2016. A majority of alarm systems manufacturers are having this for quite a time. And here is it. The launch of an Ajax motion cam sensor. That tiny piece of a puzzle that was missing is finally here to finish the entire picture. Ajax Systems Devices number 26 discloses its intent right in the name, where motion stands for PIR sensor and cam, well, for the camera. <laughs> Here I'm going to tell you what is this motion cam, how does it work, test it and show you your results and answer a question. Do you need it actually? And of course, soon this motion cam and other 25 Ajax sensors will be available for you on the People System Store website within a worldwide delivery. So specify your subscribe to get your special offer. I'm Daniel, breaking in. Subscribe to People Systems YouTube channel and get your special offer on every deal. Well, there's nothing extraordinary about a box or its contents. Just let me get the sensor out. All right, here we go. Except, well, a different type of a description mock-up on the back that highlights a top specs on the upper part. But we'll get back to this later. Right now, I want to get this one out of the wrapping. Oh. <laughs> it actually already is out of the wrapping. I don't need this anymore. So. As you could tell from the looks, comparing to a regular Motion Protect, Motion Cam did grown in hate. Due to a two new elements added, the infrared lights to lighten up a darkness and the exact camera module, capable of taking a series of five photos within a 320 by 240 resolution, or three photos with a 640 by 480 resolution maximum at a time. Uh, and then these photos are displayed to you as an animation, kind of a little video clip, in the Ajax app. But we'll get back to the test a bit later. And also, you can't take photos from a sensor if you wish. That happens only if a sensor is in armed, armed position and spotted a intruder's motion. So, above them, we got our infrared sensor behind this Fresno lens. The Ajax inscription moved closer to a bottom edge ruining a perfect metal located composition. But here I'm just being picky. To finish up with the appearance, Ajax have changed a button behind the cover on the back from a switch to a press type, as they do with all their sensors released in 2019. But enough about the looks. I know you want to know how does this work. Along with the motion can launch, Ajax also brings to the market two new versions of kits featuring a motion cam, hop 2, door protect and space control key fob in white and black colors. Because at the moment, motion cam sensor is compatible with a hop version 2 only. And it ain't because Ajax want to sell you a newer version of their device, but because it is necessary. You see, uh, the communication between sensors in Ajax ecosystem happens completely via radio waves under Ajax Jeveler radio protocol. But it is not enough to transfer images. To specify, Ajax stumbled upon that fact that images transmission conflicts with the alarm signal transmission. That is why new Ajax hub has two more antennas to ensure both of the alarm signal and the images are transferred. I mean, we're talking about a transmission of a multiple images via radio waves at a distance of up to 1700 meters which is the operational range for the Ajax motion cam this time. And the name of this new protocol is WINGS. Thus, Jeveler is used for the alarm signal transmission, while a WINGS protocol ensures images delivery. A few more things I want to highlight before we test it. A motion detection distance remains the same that Motion Protect has, 12 meters. And it has a pad immunity here as well, for a pads under 20 kg in weight and 50 cm tall. A declared built-in battery's lifelong is up to three years due to that two protocols used here simultaneously and the infrared lights with the camera on top of that. Honestly, I'm surprised with three years of battery life considering new high-consuming elements. And so the pairing connection, the activation part is no different 
for AJX motion cam and different from any other sensor except that you have to have the AJX hub generation 2 because this is the only hub compatible with a motion cam due to a two protocols two uh, additional antennas used in the uh, used to build the body which is uh, which are used for Wings protocol and Jeveler protocol. So uh, alarm signal uh, is, uh, well, as it was before, sent via the uh, Jeveler radio protocol and photos taken from this cam are sent via the Wings protocol. So now we're gonna pair it up. For that, we're going to uh, open up the lid on the back. I'm gonna go here and press and device button. Scan the QR code located on its back, name it a motion cam and assign a room to studio in my case now i'm pressing the only button i got on the back for like three seconds until i see the led shining blinking here and now i see the sensor is tied up it's paired with my hub i'm closing the lid i should even see the notification in here yeah yeah hub two lid is closed perfect right now we're gonna trigger the sensor and show you how does that happens but before we go i want to show you a few things that have changed here so as you can see now we have two signal strange fields one for a jeweler and second for a wings and wings is kind of additional because uh the first one yeah is a jeweler to transmit the alarm signal in andre 15 milliseconds this is how ajax does so we got here additionally a wing signal strength which is still loading and a camera and it says online all the other things are well the same now the settings on top here you get a well standard ajax settings for sensors which is a room delays night mode i'm in night mode and other stuff next we have a sensitivity we can choose an image resolution which is actually a 160 by 120 320 by 240 and 640 by 480 and to mention um the bigger resolution the better resolution you choose the longer will it will take to deliver a photos to you because this is how it goes it snaps it shoots the photos it sends it here and then it sends it to you and it takes time so yeah choose vice uh, i'm gonna stop on the middle option i'm gonna pick a series of three yes you're able to go for a five four three and well you got the idea and I'm gonna turn here all and also I'm gonna uh, pick a high uh, sensitivity and also we have here a Vinx signal strength test one more additional feature that come to here and here we are now we're gonna press back it saves all the settings and now we're gonna trigger the sensor to show you how does it actually works so this is what we are normally doing let's say the sensor will be here I'm arming the system, I'm closing and killing the app. Here's my phone, so imagine I'm, I'm on a job, and now we're gonna trigger it, so it will catch an intruder, and it should spot a person with this. And... <laughs> I guess it just didn't take its time. And here we are, here we are. Motion was detected. It was a bit delayed but anyways that works and as you can see now as i selected a series of three photos now let me disarm it we got here a two series of three photos and let's just wait a second just wait a little bit, a little bit. so we'll load it up and i'll show you this is how it actually looks hey now you see my intruder as well hey. <laughs> Yeah, so this actually looks, it makes a, a little animation out of that three photos and you can, well, see them separately, you can see it as a movie and you can also save it as a photos, yes, Ajax would like, and you can save it as the mp4 file as a video and this is how it actually goes. To mention the higher resolution of a photos that it takes, the longer it takes to deliver them to you. And what you see now is a photos taken in a maximum 640 by 480 resolution. Below it, you see a night mode footage in the same resolution. Then we have 320 by 240 and the night one for it. And the last one is 160 by 120 photo during daytime. 
and the night mode for it. To conclude, the motion cam is intended to quickly take a glance at what happened during event, when a sensor in your home spotted an intruder's movement, and to make sure that was or wasn't a false alarm. Anyway, now Ajax lets us to see what happened by means of the photos and not just the notifications, which is awesome. Soon, this motion cam and other 25 Ajax sensors will be available for you on the People's System Store website within a worldwide delivery. Just specify you're subscribed to us to get your special offer. I'm Daniel. Uh, thank you for watching. Your protection and your knowing of your surroundings are the main goals in the People's Systems.